Hello everybody, I hope you're doing great today. My name is Liti Sema. Today I want to talk to you about One Piece, the best-selling manga slash comic series in the entire world. By the time this video comes out, One Piece's 1,000th chapter should have come out, and I feel like this is the perfect time to try and sell people on One Piece one last time. Because, you know, I feel like it's a time of celebrating, I'm really enjoying the series, a ton of people are, but, like, you do hear that debate of, um, it's too late for me to get into One Piece, so, like, One Piece is too long, I say, no, it's not too late, you can definitely get into One Piece now, and if you don't want to watch 9 episodes, that's fine, because I have the solution to that. To counter the argument of, you know, One Piece is too long, I'd be like, too long, too long. You don't want decades of good content? Literal decades of good content? It's crazy to me because there's a lot of people who want to watch like 10 short series that are like a 6.5 out of 10 rather than watch one long series that's an 8 out of 10. And if you don't want to commit to One Piece but feel like, man, this is like 900 billion jillion episodes, you're not sure if you're going to stay focused, that's fine. I have, I've developed a plan to like essentially have you get into One Piece by saving as much time as possible. So let's get into it. Oh, guys, yeah, important though, before we continue, I need you to like the video because of algorithms. Thank you. Much appreciated. Now, back to the subject. This video isn't really for One Piece fans. It's for One Piece fans to show their friends to get them to watch One Piece. So I'm going to be keeping the video mostly spoiler free. I'm not even going to say the name of most of the arcs. I want you to watch the series and be surprised like how most of us were when we watched it. That being said, it's been out for 20 years, so most of you probably know some of the major spoilers already, but I'm going to treat this like you haven't heard anything about One Piece at all. 20 years before the series started, the man known as the Pirate King, Gold D. Roger, was executed. His death caused a new age of pirates, all of them setting out to a sea called the Grand Line with the hopes to find his treasure called One Piece. Jump to present time and 17 year old Monkey D. Luffy sets off by himself in hopes of finding One Piece and becoming the Pirate King. On his journey, he quickly meets people with their own dreams who join his crew. I actually did a lot of math for this video and um, to start off, One Piece right now, the anime has 956 episodes of it. Okay, for 956 episodes, that's a lot and you need to watch all these episodes to get into One Piece or get the appeal. No, because the first thing we can do is cut out the filler episodes. One Piece doesn't have a lot of fillers, but you know, it does have some, and they're inconsequential. So we're going to cut out the filler episodes for the episodes that matter, and of the 956 episodes, there's 76 fillers, so cut that out, now we have 880 episodes. Okay, we're down a bit, we're down a bit, that's good. Now we're going to add 11 episodes back on, because I need to see this filler arc. I know, I just said those aren't important, but like, it's the G8 arc and it takes place episode 196 to 206, and it's good. Like, honestly, when I was watching this, I didn't know it was filler till like years later, and apparently a lot of people felt the same way, because like, you know, if you want the One Piece experience, you gotta watch the G8 arc, and it's good. There are other fillers I'd recommend, but they're not mandatory to the One Piece experience. I'd say if you're enjoying One Piece and don't mind fillers as long as they're good, then I can recommend some more. Fillers like the Boss Luffy episodes where Luffy's a detective in the Edo period and everyone is an Edo version of themselves. Or the Ice Hunter arc that features the Phoenix Pirates and Luffy and everyone take on a bounty hunter group. The Toriko crossover specials I like and one has Goku in it, they're not that good but I, I, I honestly like them a lot. And the One Piece movies are pretty decent from what I remember, but I haven't seen them in so long so I wouldn't know which ones to recommend you, but I'd say they're at least worth checking out. For the other fillers though, I'm probably gonna link a guide on like One Piece Pro, so just skip all of those because it's fine, they don't, they don't add too much to the story. Okay, and with that, we're about to 891 episodes. Okay, now this one's the more drastic because right now, because right now we're at 891 episodes, and what you want to do is um you're gonna wanna watch One Piece minus the filler arcs except the G8 arc up to episode 491, and then you are gonna stop watching the One Piece anime. I'm not joking. One Piece actually has 99 episodes of filler, but I only removed 76 earlier because those were the fillers that were included in the first 451 episodes. Okay, so after episode 491, you should start reading the manga chapter 582. And I know, it's just like, a, what, but I like anime more than manga. Shut up. All right, like, the One Piece anime, it gets so bad later. And it's not like the source material is off, but it's just like, um, if the show's been running for like 20 years, and like, you know, they've caught up to the manga, because the anime was only like two years behind the manga when I think it started, and now, like, Oda, he only writes three chapters a week instead of, like, every week. So, you know, they're really catching up up and the pacing right before there's a time skip that happens the pacing right before the time skip around this point it's just awful like to explain it typically most anime based on manga will try to adapt two chapters into an episode and let's take a look at that the first big arc the east blue arc in one piece it's 100 chapters turned into 50 episodes so that's 1.9 chapters per episode then the next arc it's 117 chapters turned into 16 episodes it's 1.7 chapter per episode arc after that that's about 1.6 chapter episode not that group and then the arc after that water seven great arc by the way really good arc it's 2.1 chapters per episode and you know this this was okay but the things um once you go to post time skip the first major arc it is 56 chapters 
turned into 57 episodes. That's 0.98 chapters per episode. It's so slow. And then, oh my god, the Dress Rosa arc. I have to say his name in infamy because I think that's like when it like really hit people that they're pushing it. Because they made 117 episodes of the anime based off of 101 chapters. That is 0.86 chapters per episode. It was so slow and painful and I watched it all. My friends kept telling me to read the manga and I said, shut up, I've watched One Piece for a decade, I can't stop now. And I wish I did. I saw all of it and it was terrible. You know, from then, the next song after that, it's still bad as well and it gets worse. But just Rosa was like that point people were like, um, no, this is, this is so bad. Also in Just Rosa, you understand what is One Piece now. One Piece, it's um, at the beginning of the episode, they say Luffy, blah, 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 wants to be Pirate King. Then you have an opening, but it's not an open, it's an extended opening. And then you have a recap, it's like three minutes long for no reason. And then you have 12 seconds of episode and an ending. It's just, <laughs> it's so bad, man. And, and, and at Dress Rosa, that's when everything became apparent. It gets worse since then, but you know, Dress Rosa, that was like, um, it was my hell because I stopped watching the One Piece anime at that point. I just went over to the manga. And the, remember, the current arc in the One Piece manga and the One Piece anime, it's the same. Like, I'm sure the animation style switched up a bit, so people seem kind of interested with this current arc, but things like the pacing, it's so god awful. Because remember, Oda, he writes three chapters a month, and one episode of One Piece comes out pretty much every week. He's going to catch up so to make sure that the anime doesn't catch up to the manga. They destroy the pacing of it. They don't really, they're not big on fillers. They just destroy the pacing. And opposed to other series that have fillers, like, you know, like Bleach and Naruto. If you watch those series now, you can just skip the fillers and, you know, you can enjoy them more than you would if you're watching week to week. Because, you know, the fillers are just there because to make sure that the series doesn't catch up to the manga, but they still want to keep the anime going to keep attention there. So that's why fillers exist. One Piece doesn't do that, though, because, you know, if you, if, even if you skip the fillers and you watch the anime, the pacing's just so bad and you can't skip it because it's all canon. It's just so bad, so that's why I would say, I know, you know, if you, if you, if you like manga even a bit, even if you prefer your action series as anime, not manga, I feel like, you know, if you are a One Piece fan, I feel like the next way you should experience it is as a manga because I can't recommend that you watch One Piece past episode 4 if you want to, you know what? Maybe if you want to watch a bit more, that's fine, but like, from that point on, if you pay attention, you'll notice that the pacing has just become god-awful, and I cannot recommend anyone watch it. If you find out there's a good fight in the anime, maybe you can just check that episode out, but I can't imagine, or I can't recommend watching One Piece as your main source and only source to enjoy One Piece. I, you, at that point, you have to read the manga. Oh, god, that was a lot. Alright, let's see. Alright, so if we do all the math, because that seems to be minus the fillers, add the G8 arc, take away all the from time skip, that leaves you with 425 episodes of One Piece, and at the current moment, 419 chapters to read. A lot better than 956, and I, obviously, there may be some points where, like, um, after, you know, after episode 451, there may, there may be some points where, like, you know, you can come in and out of the anime, like, um, it's annoying. And at the end of the day, you want to do the series with fun, so I try to maximize by saying just read these chapters and back to the anime and back and forth, it's, it's, it's just too messy, so that's why I say anime to this point, Mung to this point, keep it simple. I think that's the best way to enjoy One Piece. I know, 425 episodes, it's still a lot, but then when you understand you can actually get into One Piece without watching 900 episodes, and I feel like these episodes, they are very good. I feel like this is the best way to get into One Piece. Just to make the pitch one last time, I feel like One Piece is the most consistent, long-running battle shonen. It didn't fall off. It had some weak parts, but in general, the series is still good, and people are loving the current art right now. So that's why I'd say maybe... Just give it one last chance. I know it's 2021, One Piece is long, but I feel like this is a series that means a lot to me. And I feel like if you enjoyed it, it may mean a lot to you too. All right, that's all I gotta say. Um, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe for more anime content. I do some more gaming videos as well. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh my God, Jesus Christ, it's so fucking cold. <laughs> Hey, I'm outside because it's 2 a.m. and I don't want to wake my mom and sister up. And I want the video to get to 10 minutes, so I'm just doing this extra part. I want to say, if you're an anime only watch of One Piece and you're enjoying it right now, that's good, man. That's great. I'm just saying, if you saw that Sylvanas video on One Piece fans, you're going to make us look foolish when you're putting on One Piece. And I don't know, <laughs> the pacing is just so sl slow because it takes like 10 minutes to throw a at attack. You know, that's fine. I'm just saying, you know what? If you want people to only watch the anime, that's fine. Because like, this is just the pitch. If they watch 450 episodes and they're just like, yo, I want to keep watching, not reading. That's good, man. It's the hook, line, sync. It's fine. So allow me. It's just the pitch. It's all for the sake of the fandom. It's all, it's all love. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.